Hello, hello. Welcome to the Deborah Berry channel. If this is your first time, I am Deborah Berry. This channel is about fashion and styling and doing whatever it takes, ladies, to hold on to our pretty whatever, you know, whatever it takes. And sometimes it takes a village. And I want to give a big warm welcome back to my returning subscribers. You know, I love you. I thank you. I appreciate you. Ladies, let's get the lips out of the way. First of all, how you been? I don't want to be rude. How's everybody? It's another week. We made it through another week. Yay, yay, yay. Uh, on my lips is Givenchy, you know, the, the velvet, the uh, grande. And I was going to put on the darker one. Let me show you both shades. Here's one. Okay. And here's the other one. come in these two shades hopefully you can see that and I was going to put that darker one on but I thought I put all this dark stuff on my eyes that I I just went back to the red one and I will list it you've seen it before many times of course now I got this on the hand many many times let me wipe this off it's a it's a great creamy velvet the case is velvet and I love velvet we're gonna get into velvet later in the season too but back to this now, on my nails, it's not Olive and June, it's not Revlon, it's not OPI, it is, are you ready, drum roll, I did it, I used my Sistico bond system, mineral bond, the Sistico, I used it, I actually did it ladies, Saturday, you know, and I was so apprehensive, it's like, oh, what am I going to do with this stuff? But I did it, and here you go. I'm going to show you my nails. Though they're opalescence, not what I was looking for, but who knew. But if you look closely, this hand, which is my left hand, is much darker and pinker than this hand. Of course, I did this one first. And then I got a little better. I got a little bolder over here. But it was so easy. Oh, my God. I was just so apprehensive about doing it, and is this going to work? And I mean, it's, it is so easy and my nails feel great. And I did it Saturday, so it's today's Monday. They, they're holding up pretty good. And, they, and I, it was, I just, unbelievable how quickly it, it took place. But here's the kit. I'll show you again. <clears throat> With the booklet and everything. And you get this little, this little gadget here, ladies. This little thing here, I don't even know if it's charged up enough. Anyway, you sit your hand under here after you, you put, you buff your nails a little bit after you shape them and everything. And you put that base coat on and you put it under here for two minutes and it's timed. Once you push this, the lights come on. You just sit your hand under there so the nails are under there and it goes off after two minutes. Then you put the polish on, you put the little powder on which I use this one. I'll show you the powder. Put the powder on with this little applicator here. It's double tipped sponge applicator. You put the powder on. Okay, and there's the powder if you can see in there before without me wasting it. I just dipped and put the powder on, spread it on, and then you put the top coat on, which is clear also. And you go back to the little machine another two minutes. When you come out that second time, you're done. It says wash your hands and to remove any excess powder. It's like, that's it? So I did this hand and I was like, I'll put some more. I gotta put a little thicker on. Because when you're rubbing it on, it's the weirdest little feeling of putting that polish on there and it's dull looking. But then you put that top coat on. Dreamy, dreamy, dreamy. So I wanted to take it off and try again, but I said, well, I wanted to show, show the ladies. So I kept it on, and, and plus I need to see how long it's going to last. It's supposed to last up to two weeks or something, I guess, according to what you're doing. But it was easy, and I just follow the instructions. Just follow them. So I'm going to order me some darker colors. I have a white, and I have another metallic-like color, and I... The, the pink and the white are classic, but this is some kind of metallic, and you do it a little bit different where 
it's just a matter of putting the, the top coat on and then putting something else on but I want to try this green looking gold green looking hey but I would say give it a thumbs up give it a try I'm gonna order me some more polishes now I haven't taken it off yet there's is the, the taking off part is supposed to be really fun so we'll see I'll let you know how that goes but I would highly recommend Sistico. I will list their website like I did before. Um, really nice. I mean, so quick. Usually when I do my nails, I'm shaping and doing all this. And then I put the base coat on. Let that dry about, I let it dry about 10 or 15 minutes. I'm sitting there. Then I put the first coat of polish on. And I time it for another 10 or 15, maybe 20 minutes. I want to make sure it's dry. Then I put the second color on sit again and then I put the base the top coat on and I sit probably 30 minutes I'm sitting still but I'm eating on something I got some popcorn or something I'm eating on but it's so long and because with nail polish you want to make sure it's all the way dry the last thing you want to do is nick and it wasn't dry you know and usually my husband's complaining about the smell you're doing your nails I can't I was like, my God, this does, I don't smell like that. But this has no fragrance, no chemical smell. It's all minerals and something. Even the top coat and all of that has no fragrance to it. So give Sistico, give it a try, ladies. Hey, it's a good thing. It's easy. And, you know, I ordered three colors. You can get a smaller kit, but it's worth it. I want to order me some more colors. I want to do some darker colors. And let's see now what else I wanted to tell you about I want to take a minute to talk about this aging and trying to take care of ourselves and trying to do what what we can do I was watching Nicole Johnson she does uh, makeup I'll try to find a picture of Nicole and put it up here I, I love her I love all of her her fashions oh my gosh she has some great fashions but her, she has her own makeup line if you haven't tried any I love her eyeshadows and that's I have our shadows on today but she, she has this beautiful white hair, gorgeous white hair. But she was talking about Nutrafol. And there is Nutrafol. You see, I got me some. But I've heard about it. And I had been on the fence. I've been thinking about trying Nutrafol for so long because this hair is coming out like a cheap-ass weave. And I mean a really cheap weave. And I just figured it was genetics and I have no recourse of anything. But I said, I'll give it a try. Cause she was saying she was getting thin around the edges and she started taking it so i ordered it which i have been seeing the commercials and i kept you know and it comes up on my youtube feed all the time and i said i really need to try that i really need to try that so i ordered you know you had to order a three month supply but it's these capsules and you gotta take four of them four if you knew how much i hate taking anything that i gotta swallow because most of my vitamins and everything is gummies. Gummies, gummies, gummies. And these just, I don't know what the fragrance is, but you have to take four of them with meals. So what I, I the first day I was taking, I was doing the four and it's like, oh. So I started doing two here and maybe two in, the, two in the morning or something or two in the afternoon, spread it out some. So, but that's, I got the women's balance. So we're gonna see what happens with that. Cause my goodness, We'll see. I only got these last week, so I figure it's going to take 90 days for me to see if anything's going to happen. But she did say that it, it, it you know, lessened her shredding. Her, excuse me. It lessened her, her shedding as much. And that's the main thing. I It's so much that just comes out when I'm washing it. And if I just is looking at it, it's like, and I can even, like I say, feel it pull away from the follicle. So we'll see if this helps. Couldn't hurt, huh? And one other thing I tried. I've just been trying stuff. At 71, you gotta try a few things sometimes. You gotta like maintain. It takes a little more to maintain this beauty, right? So I, you know, I have no brows. And I have been using this, I get from Amazon. I don't even, it just cut. Well, it's eyelash serum. It says eyelash serum, but you can use it on your brows. Let me see if it has a name on here. Vibe Beauty. I don't know. There's no name, but I can list it for you. I've been using this a couple of years. 
and it helped. It didn't make my brows thicker, it made them longer. Of course, now half of them are gray, but I don't, gray brows is better than no brows, right? So I've been using this, and this is about $28, you know, and you just, I just put it on the lash line and then put it on the brow line. But I have been seeing this new lasting. I know you've seen this on every YouTube uh, video or there's a, it's a interrupted with this new lasting. So, and it costs a whole lot more. But they kept talking about how bushy the brows were. So of course I ordered, I ordered the small size from Amazon. And it's basically like that. You put it on twice a day. You get this little brush for the lash line. And you get this one, this at this one. You get this other brush for your brows. I'm like, yeah, I don't have any brows to brush through, but I do it anyway. So I've been doing this maybe a, a week longer than the Nutrafol. I just got that last week, so it's only been two weeks. I don't see too much, but I know that it'll help. When you get to this age and everything's standing out, ladies, we need any kind of nutrients that can go right on and help out. So, new lasting. Check it out. I'll try to find a video or, or get their website for you. But again, it's on Amazon. I can maybe list it from Amazon and you can go and check it out. Because I didn't need to try any big, big size. for I, It was way more than that $28. It was either $60 or $70 or $80. I can't remember. But I, I got it. I got it because, you know, what costs beauty? What costs beauty? <laughs> we got to do it. So there, caught you up on what's been happening in the Deborah Berry, Deborah Berry land as far as maintenance. And sometimes it takes so much more than we're used to doing to uh, keep ourselves up. And, and now if I could just control my eating and, and get my body where I want it or where I wish it was. <laughs> Don't we all, huh? Don't we all? I, I act like I'm in some exclusive club here, but anyway, ladies, I am off my soapbox with that. Try Sister Co, try Nutrafol, try New Lastin, try whatever it takes to hold on to your beauty. <laughs> now, let's get into the topic. Topic today, I just wanted to keep it simple. I, I don't have I have only one new piece to show you and I'll show you that at the end but I, I wanted to talk about it's the season next week is Halloween Woo Halloween so I thought I'd do some black looks for you let's do some style up some some seasonal fall looks in black seasonal fall looks in black and it's like I wanted to do black from head to toe and I have a lot of black clothes and I thought about even taking the black and breaking it with a bright colored handbag which you can do feel free but I wanted to uh, just explore my closet for some black looks and, and these are pieces you've already seen like I said it's only one new piece and um, that I got last week that I really want to share that with you because I think that's a it's a good good piece when I find a good piece you know I want to share it with you and I want to thank you all for enjoying the video last week. Oh my God, you guys really enjoyed that. I, I had fun with that. I am going to get into mango because I could, mango's got me hooked almost like banana. And mango has nice prices. I just wish there was a store here, but they've got some new stuff out on there. So I, and right now they have 30% off if you spend, uh, $200 I think so you get 30% off your order which is really great because their prices aren't you know out you know way up here they do have I have to tell you a suede jacket it is gorgeous and it is real suede I think it's three three something 390 or something but the 30% off I figured out it would come to 240 something I am really thinking about getting it. It's an oversized brown. It's like a reddish brown. Really beautiful. And I thought I need that. But I need to slow down some too, right? Anyway, let me. <laughs> I have on an old black top right now. You've seen it in an old video. So I'm going to do my little three black looks for you and then let you go. But I'll be right back with the first black look. Let's get started with the black ladies and here's the beginning. You saw this top upstairs. This is the this is a top probably a couple of years old I got from Macy's. I don't even remember. I think it's an INC top, but it's all one piece. It's stretchy. It's got the 
the work around here, the peplum, the lace sleeves. Look at the beautiful roses inlaid in there. It's a mock turtle. It just pulls over. It's really, I love it. I've had it. It's a great one for the holidays, for Halloween, for Thanksgiving, for Christmas and New Year's. It's a great, great sweater. Oh, it took a while for it to get to me. I remember I ordered it in December and it didn't come till January, but I love this sweater. And I just have on my black Ralph Lauren tuxedo pants. It has the satin tuxedo stripe down the side. It has a cuff at the bottom of the leg. And my little curator clutch little clutch that has the chain strap but you know I just won't do it like this and I have on my Elizabeth Damrich shoes from uh, Dillard's the collaboration she did with Antonio Milani the potus wash shoes with the little little kitten heel cute little kitten heel so adorable just easy easy peasy <laughs> what did I say winner winner chicken dinner such a stupid phrase but that's it, and you're ready to go. And I know, I know I'm throwing you off because usually I start off very low key, very mild with the looks. I decided to just do like Fumi, dress up, put your pieces on and dress up. Do you live, do you love? <laughs> are, you, are, you, are you loving the black, my dear? Are you living for it? But I, I like it and it's comfortable. This is one you could wear with a skirt and right, and you know, I have the waist of the pants right here, kind of hitting it right there. But it's an easy one. I love peplum tops. They really flatter all figures. Put in, and you don't have to worry about that. Put it on, good to go. You are good to go. And this is just an old pair of earrings. I don't know if you've noticed. You know, I wanted to put my Tory Burch earrings on, but I said I always put those on. Let's do something a little different this time. So. I did that, and I'm good to go. My fashion, my style, my age, my choice. <laughs> I know it's a ponytail, but we're gonna work with that, right, ladies? Maybe neutral fall will make give me a fuller ponytail. We shall see, won't we? All right, I'm gonna get ready for the next look. Some more black, another black look. We're just gonna do a few, three black looks to get going and short video this week but hey pull out your black next week is Halloween and just makes you want to wear black I don't know I always I used to Halloween I used to put on a simple black dress I remember one Halloween <laughs> let me take a minute we were going to some party and I said I want to I want to just be a movie star I want to be Liz Taylor or something so I had this black dress that had a V in the back and it had a split up the back and it was just straight and it was long sleeves. I think it was boat neck. I put that on with some shoes and makeup on and I remember I went to the appointment. Who are you? I said, I'm Liz Taylor. I'm a movie star. <laughs> Better recognize, right? So you can pull it off, put that black on, dress up, dress up and be comfortable, get you a little black mask put on or a bejeweled one and you're good. You're not in all that crazy stuff. Sometimes you just want to has to be comfortable. So, here she is. My fashion, my style, my age. I'll be back with the next one. Let's do a little more black one more time. How about that? <laughs> this is the black ink sweater. This is the mango black skirt. These are the black ink, I think they're ink, boots, patent leather boots. Don't quote me on that. You can never go wrong with Tori Birch. My favorite, nice black bag with the tassel. And this is an old belt that's probably 10, 15 years, maybe even more. Had it in there, I grabbed this, put it on, put together a black look for you. Another black look, just black, black on black in black. Hey, black on black in black. But I want her to go with black. I think this, Pulling together your black pieces, you can always come up with a look, ladies. The black pieces are there in all our wardrobes, when most of our wardrobes, because when in doubt, buy black. You know, if it comes in colors and you can't decide, just get black. Black will work. Black will blend in. Black will coordinate. Black will slim. <laughs> black will stand out, even. 
it, it won't fade in the background. And again, this sweater is the one, like I had it on with the skirt last time, I think, with the red. Remember with the red sweater and the uh, red shoes with this? I'll put a picture up of me with the red and the black. <laughs> nice, right? Nice. Alright, I'm going to give you a look on that. Let me fix this right quick. Now, I'm trying to do my angle for you so I make sure you saw all of me. And again, the boots you've seen, they're the little, you know, short boots. I think they are INC. Let's see. Oh no, they're uh, Sam Edelman. I see the little emblem. I know Sam, I know my boyfriend's Evelyn now, right? Sam Edelman, I don't know where I got ink from. Here we go, ladies. My fashion, my style, my age, my choice. <laughs> so we got one more look. I'm gonna show you that piece that I got in the finale. I wanna show you that piece because I think it's a great piece to have. And it's black, it's black. I had it last week, but I didn't put it in with all the mango stuff. It's a Calvin Klein piece, just to give you a hint on that. So, and I want to thank you for spending time with me and and just being supportive and being there and being encouraging. I just love you ladies. I love you, love you, love you from the bottom of my heart. And you know, like it, give it a thumbs up, share. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Come back and hang with us. And you know I'm here every Thursday. Every Thursday just for you. So let's get one more look at this and put on the final piece. Don't ask me what's going on with my head back here. <laughs> put on the final look and you're gonna love it. It's all black again. Something old, something new. I'll be right back. Look, ladies, look. Am I ready? Or am I ready? <laughs> as Fumi as would say, are you living for the black? Do you love the black? Look at this black, and I pulled out my favorite coach tote. Ah, I've had this a few years. I love it, I love it, I love it because of the two handle deal here. You can do the short handle or the long. But look at this. This is the new piece. This is the Calvin Klein faux leather blazer from Macy's. Really nice. I think I got, did I get a medium? or six or I went up one size or I went down I can't remember I'll let you know what size I got but it's nice it's long I have it on with my Chico's black pleated faux leather skirt from last year I, I put on the Franco Sordo little casual flat boots that I showed you last week that I just got and just a basic plain black crew neck sweater from Nordstrom's a couple of winters ago but look at this jacket it's nice. It's nice. Get out a little trim of the Calvin Klein trim right there. Nice. It's not now, I have to be honest now, it's not as nice a faux leather as that brown leather blazer from last week from Mango. But it feels wonderful and it goes so well with the Chico stuff, right? Look at that. Look at that. I feel comfortable. I feel good in the black. Oh, this is my husband's hat. I got permission. He gave me permission to put his hat on because I thought, let me wear that hat. And my, I'm trying to think of the name. Karen Millen? Yeah, I think it's Karen Millen uh, necklace. I love this necklace. It just lays there. Tory Burch bracelet, one of my favorites. It's heavy, it's leather, it's got the gold trim. Nice, nice, nice. Michael Kors watch. Hoop earrings. She is good to go. She is ready. She got the assignment and she exceeded herself with this blazer. And I can even button it and, and put a belt on with it. But imagine this with a big comfy sweater with your jeans or some corduroys. You know, just, just nice. Nice, nice, nice. I don't know if this is a real pocket up here. It might be, but I would love to put a pocket square in there. You know me, grab my husband's pocket square, do it up. But I had fun with this black. And I mean, I could go on and on with black. But I thought I'll narrow it down to three because I could 
just so much black that I have that I could mix and match in my wardrobe. And I know I want you to check your wardrobe because I know we add black pieces every year. I know I'm, I, I add a black piece in the summer, I add a black piece in the spring, I add black in the fall and winter. I'm always going to add a black piece because I know I can put that in my wardrobe and it will go with what I need it to go with. It will coordinate. It will not just hang there and never get worn or used. So if you've got the black, hey, you've got a, a recipe for great style. And that's all I want you to do, ladies. Remember, leave a little kindness everywhere you go. Come back and see me next week. I have some new things that I'm waiting to come in and I didn't, they just didn't make it this week. So I had to go in that closet and come up with something to talk to you about. And don't forget to try the Sistico for your nails. Give it a try, ladies. Want to give it a try. I think you'll like it. I like it. They're not paying me for this, but I like it. And, you know, put your lips together. You could go so many places with this on and be so comfortable and so cute and so fabulous. <laughs> Until next week. Be good to yourselves and each other. Leave a little kindness. Come back and see me. I look forward to it. Bye-bye, ladies. <laughs>